Hello. Today's devotional can be found in Psalms chapter 31 verse 13. Heard the slander. Fear was on every side. Okay, so here's the thing. The fear of the unknown causes people to freak out and behave uncharacteristically. And they act in ways that they wouldn't normally act simply because they're afraid of what is out there and what they perceive to be out there. And sometimes they talk about their fears to others. And they say things that might not be true and hence where the concept of slander comes. Slander comes from fear of the unknown and powerlessness to deal with that fear of the unknown and whatever the unknown is. People gossip because they have fear and they don't know how to deal with it. So they talk to others and speculate on things, saying things that might not necessarily be true for their own comfort. They cannot accept the fact that there are different things out there that might be good. Things different than what they're used to. So they try and dismiss its credibility through slander. But slander keeps us from being the good and sensible people that God knows we can be and that we all know we can be. Slander destroys reputations. Slander breaks spirits. We should not seek to be a slanderous people Fear is of the devil, and fear is created through slander. We should not take pride in using slander as a weapon or as a way to invite comfort unto ourselves while causing harm to others. Slander is an evil. It's an evil and it's a cancer. And we should not allow it to dominate the good sensible, good-natured, kind people that we are and are capable of becoming. But people are so easily scared of everything and they fall victim to these infirmities every day and they give in all the time. It's so easy for people to be scared, but it's simply a choice. Having fear is a choice. Being slanderous with the fear is a choice. And it's one we must make on our own. We're in complete control of whether or not we slander others and whether or not we're scared. Unless we allow it to act upon us. And with that said, I love you all so very much. And I say these things humbly in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen.